I'm Nash Rhodes and this is an OU TV weather brief. Now across the state today, temperatures have been fantastic. We've had highs in the 80s, 90s, and some places even gotten to the hundreds like Woodward and Elk City. We've also had some strong winds at about 20 to 30 miles per hour and tomorrow that's going to increase to 30 to 50 miles per hour. So some fairly strong winds tomorrow as well as highs in the 80s and 70s. So what's the deal with these strong winds? Well, let's jump into our regional view. Keep an eye on this dry line off in the panhandle. This is going to slowly work east and situate itself right over central Oklahoma tomorrow morning around 8 a.m. And as it does, we're going to start to see a lot of moisture develop across the eastern part of our state. Now, this is going to act as fuel for storms later on in the day. However, we will have some dry conditions on the western side of this dry line and dry conditions mixed with those strong winds I talked about previously definitely present a fire danger threat. And we definitely have a fire risk uh, tomorrow. This is a uh, extreme risk for western Oklahoma. If you live anywhere in this region, please be advised. We are forecasting uh, fires that can develop fairly quickly. However, in eastern Oklahoma, you have a risk all of your own. This is a uh, a storm. This is a three out of five risk by the Storm Prediction Center for uh, damaging straight line winds, large hail, and even a chance of tornadoes. So please be aware if you're out and about in eastern Oklahoma tomorrow. Looking at that seven day forecast, though, we are going to drop into the 50s before we slowly start to increase to round out the upcoming week. This has been an OU TV weather brief. Have a great night.